long time no see. Welcome to another episode of Jazzy C After Dark. I am your girl, your host, Jazzy C. Before we get started, don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Hit that button at the bottom of the screen right there for all the notifications. You do not want to miss a minute. You guys, I know it's been, what, a month? I had to take a mental break. I've been keeping up with, I know, all of the stories. Been watching other blogs. They've been doing great job on reporting stories like, um, let's see, Black China and the whole Johnny Depp thing. Great reporting. Kim Pryor. Shout out to him. Tessa Tales, Tattle Tales. I'm newly subscribed. So, yes, shout out to y'all. I love y'all. I'm a newest fan right here. Woo! Okay, so. You guys to see back in effect. Um, we just gonna keep on rolling, doing our thing. I know vacation was long. I know for twenty, and I just you know was feeling mellow, and you, I got lost. <laughs> anyways, anyways, okay. So this is a recap review episode of Real Housewives of Atlanta. It's coming on. Ooh, it's com okay, so it's back on. Now we got Kenya, Candy, Cherie, and Marlo. Y'all know Cherie and Marlo are their newest ladies to get their peaches. Now, unfortunately, Portia uh, and Cynthia uh, uh, is not here this season. And Nene, uh, I think she's suing Bravo or something. I don't know. I love Nene. Her lines are almost always all the time famous or something okay but anyways um they're at a studio or something and y'all know kenya was doing a dancing with the stars she was doing her thing um as a matter of fact on dancing with the stars on your thing on that and they're just sitting at the studio because she was working out doing her thing now um marlo is talking about a billionaire that billionaire or something that she used to date like a decade ago yeah key 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 Really, Marlo? We still talking about that? And then, um, let's see. Cherie is talking about the convict that she is dating. I don't know. Uh, boring. It only lasted two minutes. Um, and she was only doing it twice a month. And now she's in retention or some type of holding it back abstinence or something girl he just got out of jail and you holding it back again mm. you'll see the red flag i point to the red afro for the red flag because that's a red flag to me because it seemed like to me if it was mine and he just got out and it was mine i would be you know what I'm confused, but these ladies is like 50. So maybe they clock has slowed down or something. I don't know. They all look good. Um, Candy, you know, Candy, um, poor and she doing the OLG thing. So they all looking good. I don't, I don't know. I'm disappointed in the sex life of them, but we all know Candy is a freak. So she going to get hers in, honey. <laughs> Okay, shouts out to Marlo. She is a monty, a mama slash auntie or auntie slash mama. Either way, I'm loving it. She stepped up. She did what she needed to do. I guess her sister is incarcerated, so Marlo stepped in, been there for the past three years for her nephew, who is now 12 and 14. Um, I love that in her because my auntie did the same thing in the situation when I was that age. My auntie became my monty, mama, auntie. So I'm loving you, Marlo, already. I love your character. Come on, come with it. Okay, so Drew told it. She didn't even wait for them to explain themselves. All right, Drew. Um, new housewife on the block, Sonia Ross. Um, she won four gold medals, um, Olympic running track, and her husband. Um, Ross, he won two Super Bowls. Uh, I don't know. He played for some blue and silver. Um, y'all figure it out with the sports shit. That's not my thing. Fashion. 
That's my thing. <laughs> Uh, let me just throw in there, uh, Sonya body is bam, bam, boogity, pow, 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 damn, mommy, ugh. Okay, can we get into how cute Brooklyn is? Little Kenya's little daughter, little Kenya, yes, she is so cute, I love it. I knew Kenya was gonna have a beautiful little girl. I don't give a fuck if her mama don't accept her or not. Kenya is a bitch, but she makes some beautiful children, honey. Can I get a mm, 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 mm for this black love right here? Ah, oh, let me manifest some shit because, oh, Lordy, and she got her husband and her mama and her daddy, and they just, well, I wouldn't recommend the mama and the daddy living up, but they moved to help her. And her career. Because he retired. He got him two rings. She got her four gold medals. Oh, let me manifest some shit. Oh. I'm doing it wrong. Drop it with Drew. 25 pounds in three weeks. Bitch, where? Where? Under which role did you lose? You know what? I'm not going to. I'm not here to mommy shame, body shame you. You said that you got a light mommy tummy tuck. How does a light mommy tummy tuck? Is that like light dressing? Is it like light yoga? Is it half the cost? So basically, Drew Sedora is in an open marriage. She just don't know about it. Because this is the second time that we done the audience at least. And they only been on what? Two or three seasons? And... Two thirds or half of the seasons, he's been caught in lies or text messages or sneaking or Tampa, maybe so not in between alleged with another woman. I'm talking about her husband. I don't even know his name. Okay, so for Marlo's first official event as a peach holder. She threw some type of couture event. It seems like it's really nice. I don't know. I'm I'm into fashion. I have just never went to this type of fashion party where she puts the dresses on mannequins. She said this is how they do it in France. It's like a stiff, boring museum where they play violins and people just kind of silent auction things or something like that. Now, what I can say is Candy can learn a few things on not trying to be cheap with the hors d'oeuvres. Hors d'oeuvres? Hors d'oeuvres? Well, however you want to call it, she got the fancy shit. Even Candy said, whoo, girl, you got the fancy shit. Now, you just know Candy is cheap. Got all that money and just as cheap as I don't know what. Is we going to talk about it? Okay, let's talk about it. Now, you know, Marlo, that the girls, that's what they supposed to be doing. It's talking. They're supposed to throw shade. They're supposed to throw shade at your little event. Okay, like I just did that at your little event. They're supposed to throw shade. That's what they, that's what your housewife's for. And then you supposed to go back, but not at your event. You ain't supposed to kitty cat cat get that at your event, Marlo. You don't have to feed into the negativity. You really don't. Don't feed into the negativity. Now, I don't know if Cherie and Sonia, uh, y'all ran back, uh, like some gossip girls to just go tell. Y'all should have left that for another time and place. This is her event. You're supposed to be bringing her positive energy. I don't know, Cherie. Maybe somebody should have gave you a slice of a peach. You should have been a friend. I don't like that first, that first event. event. I don't like that first act on your peachness. I don't. Now, where is your fashion show? Where is she by Sheree? Because you busy going to other folks' fashion shows, but we have yet to see where is your line. 
She by Sheree. Girl. Tell that. Run, tell that. <laughs> they put up a croissant next to her hair. <laughs> side by side. <laughs> now, it's been a while since I've seen a French row, but Marlo, it ain't been no 50 years. She said it's 50 years. <laughs> Well, they was trying to come for Marlo at her event. I mean, you don't do that. You know Marlo is going to throw shade back. You know she is. Okay, Kenya, who are you? Candy, black woman to black woman. Really? That's what, we, that's what we doing? And Drew, really? Are you even in the business anymore? <laughs> I love it. I love it. Keep the shade coming, Marlo. Keep the shade coming. <laughs> And that is another recap review episode of Real Housewives of Atlanta right here on Jazzy C After Dark. Thanks, guys, for tuning in. Don't forget to tune in. Make this a part of all of your regular YouTube uh, review. Um, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, guys. Leave some comments. Let, let me know what you think. Um, like, share, subscribe, and... I love ya.